here, rule number three, subjects, uh, some subjects always take singular verb even though the meaning may seem plural. These subjects always take singular verbs like each, either, neither, one, no one, everyone, someone, anyone, nobody, somebody, anybody, everybody, like that, okay? So they always take singular verbs. So someone in the game was not were hurt, okay? Was, okay, neither. Anyway. Uh, if you can see this indefinite pronouns, usually we like somebody, something, someone, anybody, anything, anyone, everybody, everything, everyone, and nobody, nothing, no one, like that. They always take singular verb, okay? Neither of the men is not, not are working, okay? So neither of the men is working. Remember those words, okay? Now, rule number four, the following words may be singular or plural depending upon the use in the sentence some any all or most okay so remember this one most of the news is good so news is taken as singular okay it's not plural so it's is most of the news is like most of the cake is also okay so cake is just singular so most of it is eaten like that singular but this most of the cakes like that this is this falls to number two most of the flowers were yellow most of the cakes are eaten like that okay remember after the of okay of the phrase when using most of or and all after the of uh, you have to take a look at it because uh, the verb agrees with the uh, with those of the phrase okay oh, I mean the object of that of breath of the phrase Next, like all of the pizza was gone, so pizza is singular, okay? So that's all of the pizza. So that means uh, the whole pizza, anyway. Next, all of the children were late. Children is countable noun, usually. Non count noun, singular. Uh, count noun, plural. Okay, so there we go. We have here each of the girls. Although girls is here, uh, no, the subject here is each, and girls is the subject of the preposition of, and it does not affect the subject verb agreement, okay? So each looks, everybody was, okay? Neither is, is each, okay? Remember of uh, prepositions, uh, those like men, girls, and stuff like that, they're the subject of the preposition, and they don't affect the subject verb agreement, remember that. Several of the ship. Okay, several. Several are. Okay, several. Next, some members of the faculty are. Okay, some members. Okay, nobody in the class has. Each of the girls observes because of each. All of the milk. Again, non count noun. So it's is. Okay, next, most of the seats. It's plural. So work. Okay. There you go. I'll begin to post more later on. Bye-bye. Okay, here again we have subjects joined by and always takes plural verb and subjects joined by or and nor. The subjects, is, uh, the subjects are always found after nor and or words, okay? So example number one, Bob and George are living. That's why it's are living. It is because the subjects are Bob and George, which are plural or compound subjects. Next one, neither Bob nor George is living. Uh, the reason why the, it's, the verb is, is living it is because the noun or the subject after nor is George and it's singular. Next, nor, neither Bob nor his friends are living. It's are living it's because the word or I mean the subject after nor is friends and it's plural. Next, here and there, you always have to check the subjects uh, what's this? after them. Like, there were five books on the shelf. Where? It is because uh, there are, like, like, the subject is books. Five books, okay? There you go. Next, here. Report is singular, so that's why here is. Okay? Now, uh, collective nouns like army, audience, class, club, etc. Et always can either be uh, plural or singular, depending on the, their use in the sentence, okay? If this, uh, the members of this collective nouns are doing things separately, that means it's plural. But if they're taken as a unit, I mean, they're doing things uh, as a whole or as, yeah, as a unit, they take singular verb, okay? Like, for example, the orchestra is playing a hit song. So, the whole orchestra, I mean, all of the members were, are, are playing as this. Uh, a hit song, so that means they're taking as a whole, and that's singular, okay? But the orchestra were asked to give their musical backgrounds. Each member are giving their own uh, their own musical backgrounds, and it's 
Plural, because it's it's of them, right? So that's why. Okay, there you go. Here, Margot and her parents visit each other often. Okay, Margot and, par and her parents visit, not visits. Not visits, but visit, because it's plural subject with Margot and her parents. Connected by N. Either the cups or the glasses. So the glasses is the subject here. So it's plural, so it's R. Number three, Ben and Fred. Okay, connected by N. It's need. There is or are a dog, a cat, and a bird. So it's the plural subjects. It's are. Okay, there you go. Neither Matt nor his brothers. A subject here is brothers after the word nor. So were. Next, here into the main ring of the circus, come. The trained elephants. Elephants is plural, so that's why come. Next one, either the workers or the boss. Boss is singular. After the or, that's the subject. So delivers. Next, the committee works hard for the better school. So the whole, uh, the whole, uh, the committee as a whole. So that's why it works. There is or are many things. Things is plural, so that's there are. Next, the jury blank pulled for their verdict. So they're voting individually. So that means it's plural. So the jury were pulled for their verdicts. Next one. Nails is plural. So that's why here are the nails you need for the project. Next, either Joyce or Ellen. Ellen is singular, so it was. Okay, next, the United States is a country of contrast, even though it's, uh, states is a, is with this, but still, it's a country, okay? It's the name of a country, so it's singular, and it's is. United States is a country of contrast. Next one, a magazine and a, a, a book were laying on, were lying on the, floor, on the floor. Next one, the family... Individual problems, so this are occupied by their individual problems. Okay, there you go. Bye bye for now. Okay, here expressions of time, money, measurement, and weight are usually singular when the amount is considered one unit, like five dollars is okay, five dollars, ten days, ten kilometers, and stuff like that. Okay, uh, always take singular, singular verb. Okay, on occasion, however, these terms are used in the plural sense, like there were 30 minutes. Okay, there were 30 minutes. In this case, 30 minutes. Okay? Uh, how many? It's, it is uh, <coughs> not it's like asking for how much or how long. Okay? This is how many. So that's why there were 30 minutes. Some nouns, while plural and form, are actually singular in mean like mathematics, physics, aquatics, economics, they all, uh, news, and stuff like that. They're all singular verbs. Okay? Uh, they always take singular verbs. Okay? Mathematics is an easy subject for some people. Physics is taught by Professor Baldwin. Okay, there you go. Like also other words like moms, missiles, physics, acrobatics, home economics, calisthenics, gymnastics, aesthetics, social studies, statistics, phonics, species, economics, civics, news, and mathematics. They always take singular verb. Don't and doesn't must agree with the subject, the doesn't, after he, she, it, and stuff like that. Okay, anyway. Here. Moms is. $100 is. She doesn't. 20 minutes is. It doesn't. I mean, sorry. It's it doesn't because of the word, uh, the subject it. Gymnastics is. Interesting news is. Okay. A pound of cookie. A pound of cookie is uh, cost. Okay. A pound. Cookies is a, a cookies is this object of the preposition of. And they don't. He doesn't. Okay. There you go. Bye bye. Hello, hello, teachers. I have here subject verb agreement. Uh, let's try to answer this. Uh, your friend talk or talks too much. Okay. So in this case, you, since the subject is friend and it's singular, you, we will have singular verb and it talks. Okay. Next number two, the man with the roses. Okay, look or looks like your brother. The subject is men, not the roses, because it's uh, roses is the subject of the preposition with. Okay, so the subject is men. Since it's singular, it also takes singular verb, and that's looks. Next, the women in the pool swim or swims well. So the subject here again is women, not pool, because pool is the uh, object of the preposition in. So our verb here, uh, no, our subject is women, which is plural, so it will have, it will take plural verb, which is swim. Next, bill, drive, or drives, a, a cab, so it's drives, singular, since bill is singular. Next one, the football players run or runs 
five miles every day. Okay, so plural players, so it's run every day, five miles every day. Next, that red-haired lady in the far hats live or lives across the street. Uh, the subject here is lady. Okay, so it must take singular verb, and that's lives. Next, he cooks dinner for his family. That's normal. Uh, uh, this uh, subject is he. The boys walk or walks to school every day. Remember, boys is uh, plural, so it takes plural verb walk. Walk. Next, the weather on the coast appear appears to be good this weekend. So singular weather. So it's singular verb appears. Next one, the center on the basketball team. Okay, uh, bounce or bounces the ball too high. So the subject is center. Basketball team is also just object of the preposition and on in a way. So center and this bounces. Okay, there you go. That's the basic for the subject verb agreement. I'll be posting more videos later on.